What's up, my friends? Welcome back to our blind let's play of The Witcher. Here we are with Geralt, and we're still in Abigail's hut here. Um, I did a little bit more farming, and I'm gonna sell her some of these damn heads again. Also, it seems like we are pretty much done with this whole damn chapter. I wouldn't say we're done, because I have no idea, but I'm saying that we're at least coming to a head here on what the hell is going on. And we need to get back to the Reverend. So, with all said and done, let's go ahead and talk to Abigail. What do you want? I was about to say the vendor doesn't want that. Come on now. So 50 sells for 250 orange. We have 3,384. I don't know. That's probably good enough for now. Abigail is kind, but her tea is off. I would say we should probably meditate to daytime, huh? We probably should have did that. I'm gonna go meditate to daytime. So I was doing uh, a little bit of farming, right? And, um,. I don't know if it was a glitch or a bug or I have no idea, but I was doing it right here. And there was a dog here that died. And when he died, it spawned like 15 freaking Bargus. 15 or 20. I wish I would have had got that on camera. I guess it was a bug. I have no idea. But, uh... I mean, obviously, group style just mowed him down like it was nothing. It's crazy. What's up, big guy? Let's go to the daytime. There's no point in running around at night anymore. Maybe we'll catch some people um, during the day that we never see. No need to rush. You know, I wish I could sell that guy some books out here. I'm gonna go sell this uh, hellhound thing. My yeah, yeah. Did I already read it? Make sure I already read it. I'm just gonna go to the Reverend. All right, there's the good old faithful Reverend. Freak or not, you may prove useful. Freak or not, huh? Look at him sweeping. What are you sweeping? Dirt and grass. Hey, you big putts. Speak quickly. I know where the beast comes from. Was it summoned by the witch? The beast appeared because of human wickedness. To slay it, I'll need to identify the guilty. There may be wisdom in your words. When sheep run astray, the good shepherd must bring them back onto the righteous path. Otherwise, they fall prey to wolves. I'll learn all I can to defeat the beast. I must gather all the villagers. Here's your prize, witcher. Two hundred arons. Well, thanks. Well, I guess we're done. Let's look at the journal here. The Reverend promised to deal with the beast. It's time I did 
what I need to do and dealt with Salamandra. Knights should fight but monsters. Alvin? Witches they think are of nothing but money. The Reverend looks after me now. How did you get here? The Reverend plucked me from a witch's claws. Claws? That's what he says. Do you like living here? It's my chance to become a decent man. I'll keep my fingers crossed, kid. Okay. What is Alvin? He just plucked? He just took Alvin from... Abigail? The Reverend says the eternal fire saved me. But I'm certain it was you. Yeah, it was definitely us. I have to go. The Reverend will be angry. Speak quickly. I see you took Alvin in. It was my duty. Was I to let the witch corrupt him? I suppose not. When I'm gone, the people will need a new spiritual guide. And I take it you'll be his teacher. For once in your life, you're right. What an idiot. Can we kill this guy already? Yeah, let's keep pushing him. Speak quickly. I see you took Alvin. It was my I suppose when I'm... Doesn't he need a mother? What do you know? The child may now save his immortal soul. I have led him toward the eternal fire. I'm burning away his sins and weakness. And it's none of your concern. What a freaking ass. You know, before we... We're gonna do some running around here. But before we go and tell him about the villagers because I feel like that's gonna trigger something. It might even trigger a cutscene or something. I don't know. I haven't said it thus far and it doesn't look like it's pushing us somewhere so that's obviously the thing that's gonna push us. I'm gonna go back to uh, Abigail here. Alrighty. What do you want? Can I ask you something? If you must. Where's Alvin? The Reverend snatched him as he was fetching water. Why did he do that? Because his heart is as black as those of all the rest. Do you hate all humans? Yes. You don't know what it's like to live here. To endure their evil looks, their whispers, while knowing all their dirty secrets. I'm no favorite either. A few noble deeds and you'll depart. This is my home. Yeah, she has a pretty Can bad Can I ask here. you something? If you must. See you all right. Now, back to the Reverend. Back to the old trustworthy Reverend. Still can't believe he took Alvin. That's so weird. Abigail was a bad influence, the Reverend says. Well, the Reverend's a freaking idiot. He doesn't know nothing. Look at him. Still sweeping dirt. Speak quickly. Odo's and Heron's monsters are gone. For Mikkel, I cleared the Crypt of Ghouls. I must admit I'm impressed. You may yet defeat Salamandra. To do that, I need to know where to find them. I will say nothing until you eliminate the Beast Witcher. That is my condition. I mean, what else does he want us to do? We can't even find the Beast. He won't even fight us. I've done all you asked. Where's the Salamandra hideout? Go to the inn. Where a group of Salamandra's service has taken over. They hide in the old house. Olaf will have a key. And Witcher? Yes? Nothing. May the eternal fire shine on your soul. Tell the villagers to stay at home now. I don't want anyone getting hurt. I must go to the inn. Okay. I was right to trust my gut feeling. The villagers knew location of Salamandra's hideout. It seems the bandits extorted protection money from the locals and carried off their children for some unknown purpose. They're not based. They're not based in the outskirts, but I sense I am going to face a large, well-organized group. For now, I must penetrate the Salamandra's hideout in one of the abandoned houses. But I say go to the inn. What what abandoned house? The Reverend revealed the location of the Salamandra hideout. He also claims I'll find a key to the lair of the inn. Well. 
looks like everyone is going inside their house now so it's I'm telling you man good to go with that gut feeling because everyone is going inside so this is probably on the lines of um creeping towards the end of it now point of no return shall we say I guess considering there's no one even outside anymore here Well, I'm pretty content with what, what we did. If this is the end, uh, I think we did really well. The Royal Huntsman's still out and about, and that's good. I think we did really well, considering we got everything done. We did, we had dice that's going to follow up in the next act, probably. This fighting, this hot potato thing from Heron Brog. Then the rest of it is just Salamandra. And then, of course, Baron Guard's secrets. All right. Good enough, my friends. Good enough. It's crazy why the Reverend even took uh, Alvin. From what I'm aware, they, they don't seem to be... They don't really seem to be um, this Eternal Fire thing in this game, at least. They don't seem to be big into magic and able to show signs of magic so it's so weird that he would even take uh, Alvin doesn't even make sense well it's definitely cleared out in here now because there's no one even here about Shani no leave me alone Ooh, little dove, cue us a different tune. <laughs> Keep your hands off me! She is feisty. Say, let's do what we did unto Mickle's girl, Ilsa. What a screamer. <clears throat> you knew too? He likely told you to wait like us. Let's have our way with this little chicky. It so happens that this lady is with me. None of you will touch her. So you say? We aim to have our fun and you won't stop us. Is that so? I'm going to kill you, you busted. Jesus. So these guys raped uh, poor Mickle's girlfriend. All right, Shawnee. Time to die. Geralt, you arrived just in time. Are you all right? I am now. They surprised me. All the peasants ran out and I was trapped. They killed the innkeeper. That's the last time they hurt anyone. That was some swift sword work. As for me, I'm done delaying. I need to get to Vizima. I hope to see you there. Let me walk you to the gate. These roads can be dangerous. No, you need to deal with the salamanders. Don't worry about me. I'll wait for you here. Make them suffer, Geralt. For me. I'll come back for you, Shani. I'll be waiting. The innkeeper. I should check his pockets. Poor Olaf, man. I'm hoping everyone else got out. We don't see their bodies here, so... Hopefully Kalkstein and Lovard and all the rest of them. Zoltan got out as well. So the only thing Olaf has on him is a key. Thank you, pal. Well, at least we got rid of these scumbags. Now that we know who officially, um... What they did to... Or Mikkel's girlfriend. No wonder she took her life, man. I don't want this club. I wish I could see how much it sells for. I wish there was a way. Take the axe. I'll wait for you here. Go. There's a dagger all the way over here. 
All right, Shani. Take it easy. That was a damn good end, my friends. We got our fist fighting going there. We want a bunch of money in there. I don't know, man. I feel like something more is going on here. Like, them guys were right there were bandits. I still feel like... The bigger picture is yet to be revealed, obviously, but... I don't know, man. I feel like the Reverend and all his merry bunch are in on something here. They just can't be innocent. And I want to find out what the hell's going on with Abigail. Where the hell is this place even at? Um... Salamandra's hideout. Huh. Good thing I was running the right way. Where's your tribute? What tribute? I mean the kids, fool. Let me pass. No tribute, no entry. This is pointless. The kids? You're dead. So what are they, slavers here? Holy moly. I think I see what the hell's going on. So Salamandra is asking for tribute, but what's his name said they were I'm gonna I'm gonna go over here, so I think yeah. I'm gonna go over here and get Um There used to be a place of power. Not used to, but there was a place of power over here. It's not here now. The um Ard sign upgrade. I'm going to take some damn potions while we're at it. Swallow. Can we take anything else? Cat. Let's take some Tony out. Throw it. Circle of the Windy Wanderer. Here we go. Anyways, Heron was saying they paid tribute. The Salamander's protection. But is there tribute freaking kids? Is that why the Reverend wanted Alvin? Is he paying tribute with Alvin? No. It might be. Holy moly. Really messing here. Easy peasy. So many freaking daggers, man, that we cannot pick up. More of these brooches. Obviously, it's going to be a something. Remains. What is this? It's like Heron Brog's goods, isn't it? Because of the, uh, I remember the two hammers here and the sun, like the Nilf Guardian looking thing. It could just be a reuse stuff because they reuse a lot of the same bodies in here. Those crates look familiar, like Heron's goods that I saved from the Drowners. The son of a bitch is trading with Salamandra. So these are... the goods from Heron. He's trading with Salamandra instead of... So he wanted us to go kill the elves, probably, to give more goods to Salamandra. 
I don't even care now that we gave the good city elves. I feel like we did the right thing. This scumbags, he's trading with Salamandra and other people are trading kids to Salamandra. So Heron... Good grief. I knew all these fuckers were shady. Where's the action? You took your time. You have something of mine. No longer, I'm afraid. And you, like your predecessor, you work for rapists and murderers. Enjoying it? Where's Berengar? That dolt ran off. But during our brief acquaintance, he was certainly more talkative than you. No wonder, given Azar Javid's persuasiveness. Who's Azar Javid? A powerful mage. You're no match for him. We'll see. Your courage isn't lacking, Witcherette. We'll see how you fare after Azar gets you. Did you say I work for murderers? That lice-ridden village hick Odo came to us for advice on how to kill a warrior. We said someone so pathetic could only fight soldiers in dreams. This is a scintillating conversation, but it's time for some action. We don't have what you seek. It's not here. They took it straight to our base in Vizima. Too bad. Let's dance. All together, at him! Alright, so now Odo definitely... Now we know Odo definitely killed his brother. Die, bastard! So we got what's his face working for the Salamandra, giving them good. Odo killed his brother. What do we have on Mikko and the Reverend? Oh, there's Alvin down here, so. Looks like the Reverend is yes! trading people to Salamandra. The only thing, what do we have on Mikko? Maybe he took part in raping of the, the girl. Maybe she never was his girlfriend. He just imagined that. That was some neat sword work. Alvin, why are you here? The Reverend sent me to this deserted house. He said someone would be waiting there for me. That son of a... <clears throat> I'm glad you're safe. I overheard them saying we'd be taken to Vizima. To Vizima? That's where I need to go to find Salamandra. Follow me. We'll find a way out of this cave. That wall looks pretty thin. Maybe we can break it down. Let's try. Harold and Alvin, adventuring together. He did say he wanted to be a witcher at one point, didn't he? Ruby ring. Go ahead and put that on so we save some space. Book of the Tony L. That's cool. Contains Tony L, binding weed, and. Wait, honey. Mutton leg and more money. You know what I'm going to do? This thing didn't sell that much. It was like 10. I'm going to take the steel sword. I bet you that will sell more. Where are we even at on the map? We're in some kind of cave. Drop this because it's sold for 40. More books of Antonio. Alright, so maybe Abigail isn't as uh, guilty as what we, uh, these guys are believing. Maybe they're trying to throw us off the killer, it seems. Because it seems like each one of these bastards have some kind of guiltiness going on here. And it was probably them. Just like Geralt said, they summon, um, human summoned it with human wickedness or something like that. This is pretty cool, man. Really awesome turn of events to the story. They want to take us away from our parents. Please don't hurt me. Not gonna hurt you. All right, Alvin, I'll blow it down, bud. Eat that. Let's go ahead and get some uh 
Got a weapon buff on. Don't know if there's a big boss fight up here. Ah, there we go. Hey, this looks familiar. So this part opened up and that's new. This is that one cave we pretty much left out on. We came here and there was like nothing here, remember, but that cauldron. Why did you come here, Witcher? Why are you here, Witch? I'm brewing up another spell. Why? Lots of smoke in your magic. Mighty ingredients make mighty spells. Mighty enough for the whole village. Why are you doing this? The angry mob has come. Burn the witch, they cry. She has summoned the beast. I must defend myself. Men summoned the beast with their wicked deeds. I'm not surprised. Honest Mikkel violated Ilsa. She took her own life. You profited from the poison. Odo killed his brother for coin. The Reverend exiled his daughter when she became pregnant. Now she whores herself in Vizima. Heron sold a squirrel to the guards for gold. You knew, but did nothing. They trade their gold for poisons and other potions. No business of mine how they're used. It's clear why the beast haunts you. I need to expose the guilty. Stay here while I speak to those outside. Don't let them harm me. My sins are not as great as they say. Really? Learn for yourself if you like. We're alone. We have some time. Is she trying to bang? Is she, is she trying to get with us? Man, she might be pretty guilty too here. But then again, like I said about the poison, right? There's people that make the poison and sell it. I mean, they obviously need money. That's her trade. She's applying her trade. It's not her problem what people use it for. She's just kind of selling it. But I can see why I guess she is wrapped up in a mix here. Well. I'm guessing we can tell her no or yes. Fuck it. Let's go Abigail. with it. Abigail. I was drawn to you from the start. Holy moly. Well. I must face the mob of villagers outside and pass judgment. That doesn't sound good. Alvin, did you witness all that? Probably did. I want to make a save here. We have all types of stuff going on. Alvin lived with Abigail until the witch gave the boy to the reverend. The preacher gave the orphan to a group of salamander thugs who demanded that the dwellers of the outskirts surrender their children. I killed the bandits and saved Alvin. As our Javed. Now that's his name. Instead of mysterious mage. Interesting. It's a pretty darn good name for a Zeracanian person. He's definitely Zeracanian. Look at him. Zeracanians are like Middle Eastern type of uh, the way they look. The only Zeracanians we ever met was uh, the ones in the Golden Dragon one, the Golden Dragon uh, book. Teo and Veo or something like that. The ones that was that was that was with Borch. I think we also met a Zeracanian mage at some point as well. The serious mage name mage is Azar Javed, an exotic name suggesting that he comes from a distant place. Yeah, it's gotta be Zeracanian. Gotta be Zeracanian. He could be somewhere else though. There's another place out there too that's Middle Eastern type. We're just gonna go with it. Assuming that he's from there. Anyways, let's go ahead out here and pass judgment on what the hell is going to happen. Tony Owl, Swallow, Blessing of Air. Alright. B burn the devil's m mistress! Let the bitch die in pain! The witch hides within. Let the eternal fire consume her sinful body, and we'll be rid of the beast. Not so fast. She must be judged fairly. That bitch ruined my life! She cast her spells on my brother! 
wanted to steal him and his gold. My brother scorned her, so she did the devil's magic on me, used me to kill him. The treachery! I came across a doll that resembled you in her hut. I dream of it even now, her magic committing the murder. She should die! You know, could very well be true. Maybe we were a bit hasty with sleeping with Abigail, but I still don't, I still don't think that's the case. I think, I think he killed his brother willingly. I don't like these guys, man. I, you know what? Screw all these bastards. Your brother was a warrior. You're nothing but a drunk. How could you have killed him unless he was sleeping? Why listen to him, Reverend? He's a mutant, a f freak, a, a witcher. What are your charges, Haran? She she made me a hawker. She p p promised herself to me if I helped the Skyatel. I detest non-humans, but I had to, to, to trade with them. You've done all right for yourself. G gold isn't everything. There are principles to abide by. She promised herself to me, so I went ahead and... I became a bandit and sold stuff to the Squirtel just because she promised her. Get out of here. You're an idiot. Sure. Definitely don't believe this trash. You trade with bandits who kidnap children. I don't believe one word of what you say. Have you made your decision? What do you think, Reverend? The witch used Odo and Haran. She poisoned Ilsa. Mikkel raped Ilsa? Well, it seems I was right. So what, was Mikkel... ...dreaming that he was with her? Like a... a ...stalker, I guess? And that poor girl... ...killed herself? That's probably what it was. Good grief. So he was the worst one out of all of them, then. Mikkel raped Ilsa, who took her own life. Abigail should have departed long ago, but stayed to exact revenge for the evil fate that befell her. She used the devil's magic on these simple people and summoned the beast. Whoa, whoa now. Is that a lot to read here? Okay. You're right, Reverend. Uh, you know, I'm not siding with these guys. I don't believe we should just burn Abigail at a stake here. I don't think she's as guilty as these guys are. I think they're all guilty, but I, don't, I think she's... Well, I'm going to use the famous Witcher line. I think she's honestly the lesser evil. Shut up, you bastard. You lead this band of rogues, so you must know they sell children to the salamanders. And you knew about the rape and murder. I spit on you. You're all the same. All guilty. You'll regret this. I'm getting Abigail. Return to your homes. Since the beginning of time, woman has been the nest of all evil, the tool of chaos, party to the conspiracy against the world and the human race. Woman is ruled solely by corporal lust. To satisfy her insatiable hunger and unnatural desires, she gladly serves demons. They intend to kill us. Don't be afraid. There she is! Burn the foul witch! No one is burning anyone. Friends, they wish to scare us. Fear not! They're helpless as long as we stand together! Is that so? Be gone, witcher, and leave the witch, or we'll burn you too. I'd like to see you try, pleb. Ah! Shove off, and maybe I'll let you be. You have two options. Wait until I leave and then murder Abigail, but then I'll come back. I'll slay every lice-ridden peasant, anything that moves and can't climb a tree. Or you can try to lead honorable lives, clear your conscience, start again, like humans. The choice is yours. Thank you, Geralt. Let's go. We need to deal with the beast. Oh. Totally just wrecked them.
shit. Okay. Oh. That was easy. Holy shit. Helping that whore was your last mistake. Die, bloody mutant! I've enough strength for the two of you. Odo, grab the pitchfork. Hello. Uh -oh. Damn, they just killed her. Son of a bitch. How did we one shot? We one shot the beast, man. Okay. Sorry, Abigail. I'm saving these suckers for last. Where are you at? How the hell did I do that? Who gets it first? Goodbye. Huh. That was great. I'm literally gonna wait until we can one shot them all. Reverend, you're getting it last. Oh my god. Goodbye. This is great. Damn, Abigail's still down. She down or she dead? You know... Come on, Sugger. I can't believe we killed the beast that quick. You scared? You running? Come on, Sugger. Hit me. Get him out of the fire. Burn an eternal fire. You're burning yourself, dummy. Okay. Sadly, we couldn't get him on kill count because he was all weirded out. Thank you, Geralt. I owe you my life. I'll gather my belongings and leave this damnable town. Traces from the beyond. Good plasm and a ring. 120 orns, huh? There's the 120 orns that we, uh... He refused to pay us. Hey man, I wish we could've got a kill cam on the Reverend, man. That's all good. He was scared shitless, you see him? You'd rather go over there and jump into a fire than fight us. Letter of safe conduct and 250 orns. Cool. Geralt, what would have happened to me without your aid? I'm glad you found it in yourself to believe me. <laughs> Chose the lesser evil? Yeah, we kind of did. Uh, no point in rubbing it into our face, though. Who would I be otherwise? Thank you. Farewell. I must go to the inn and get Shani. So we're leaving here. Damn, that was a quick change of events. We hereby declare the bearer of this document to be a loyal servant of the Order of the Flaming Rose and a faithful follower of the Church of the Eternal Fire. By the will of King Foltes and the Grand Master of the Order of the Flaming Rose, the bearer may pass into and out of Azima freely at any time of day or night. Furthermore, he is ex exempt from all quarantine restrictions. Jacquees, Jacquees de Aldersburg. Well, that was a really cool ending, my friends. I'm wondering if we can, um... Now, I wonder if we can... Still give that guy his, um... Damn, look at all the villagers that's slain. I wonder if we can still give that man his, um... Parcel. Coleman, I think his name was. Man, Abigail's about to die. Nah, she'll outrun it. Should we just let her die, or... We'll help her.
Johnny, she's just chilling by herself. Geralt? Are you alright? I was so worried. I'm fine. I'll tell you what happened on the way to Vizima. I'm done with this village. So am I. I hope I never return. It's unfathomable how many criminals live here. These are hardly pleasant times, Geralt. The plague, impending wars. Still, I'm astounded. Do you know how the beast came to be? No. They unknowingly created it with their misdeeds. A powerful sorcerer couldn't have matched it. And all they needed was hatred, baseness, and greed. It sounds like a fairy tale. Every tale contains a grain of truth. Let's go. Vizima awaits. Okay, I'll follow her to a point, but I don't want to trigger anything else here. I don't want to trigger... What did it say? I have to talk to Mikkel? Hopefully we can kill that bastard too. I dragged Shani into business with Salamandra and although the girl was in danger, it all ended well. Shani finished what she had to do in the outskirts and return to Vizima, her house in the her house in the temple quarter. The Reverend informed the congregation that Abigail had uttered the curse of the hellhound, and the witch was surrounded by an angry mob I decided that she didn't deserve to die and saved her from being lynched. Abigail left the outskirts for good. Damn it. Cause we still got We still got these damn heads I wanted to sell her. All good. I wonder what happened to Zoltan. You know? He kind of just... Disappeared, I guess? Look at the journal here. Johnny and I are going to Vizima. We must reach the gate Mikko is guarding. Baron was captured by Salamanders, but managed to escape the organization and interrogated him. What they ask, what did they ask, and what did he betray? Only the Witcher himself can answer that. Baron probably fled to Vizima. I interrogated the leader of the gang at the outskirts and gained some new information. The man mentioned someone named Azar Javed. I should remember that Alvin said bandits often mentioned Vizima. Okay, because this gives me time to go ahead and mop up the rest of this journal before we actually leave here. It's pretty cool that Shani is still in this. She didn't really play much of a part here in the outskirts. She, Christ, that. I... Honestly, it would have been better if Alvin just stayed with her. Instead of being, um... Given to... Abigail. And then the Reverend Dam took Alvin. That's crazy, man. Like, I expected these guys to be shady, because they honestly sounded like a bunch of shysters. I didn't think they would try to push everything for us to kill a Abigail like that. I don't even know if I could side with them, guys, just to see the other ending, because it just doesn't seem like Abigail deserved death, to me at least. She was by far the lesser evil out of them. She might have been a witch, this, that, and the other, but still, she definitely didn't do as much as what they did. Mikkel deserves death, so if we can kill him, we're going to. Look at her, she even runs like a woman. That's a really cool man. <laughs> For an old game, they got it all down packed pretty good. I know Mickle's by the mill. I don't want to go too much farther up there. I don't want the trigger. Okay, she's stopping. Vizima lies beyond this gate. I hope we never return here. Me too. The beast is dead. The salamanders are dead. And the peasants. Hmm. I have a pass. Mikkel should let us enter. Let's go. Geralt, talk okay. to the guard. Let's get out this of here. This is a good point for, to stop so we don't start something new. 
Anyways, my friends, um, crazy turn of events here. I'm happy that we actually, f I'm guessing we're done with this, this act and we're going to more the next one. So it was really, really, really good. And usually first acts are just the beginning of games are usually tutorial type of stuff. So if we have more of this type of stuff to look forward to, we are in for a treat, my friends. Anyways, I'm out of here. Y'all take it easy. Have a good one. Till next time. See y'all then.